Hello and welcome to Easy Ecom. In this tutorial, I will walk you through the process carrier partners need to follow for integrating with Easy Ecom. The integration is of outbound type, where the carrier needs to set up endpoints from their end. Easy Ecom will hit those endpoints and post the request body. The first step of integration is creating the three endpoints for authentication. Create shipment and cancel shipment. Authentication is the first endpoint we hit from our end while integrating the carrier from Easy Ecom and also while assigning a shipment for any order. Once we get 200 response from your end, we will hit the create shipment endpoint. Note that anything other than 200 is an error response. In the create shipment call, we will pass order details according to the request post parameter format. You can map the necessary details required for assigning the shipment. Easy Ecom system will consider 200 as a successful response. The expected response will be tracking number and carrier name. You can also share the label document's public URL if required. In case an Easy Ecom user manually cancels the order or unassigns the carrier from the order, Easy Ecom will hit the cancel shipment endpoint. The expected response from your end will be shipment cancellation in the carrier panel. Apart from authentication, creating shipment and cancel shipment responses, you can send order tracking updates. Please refer to the update tracking status function mentioned in the API document. Note that you need to pass shipping status IDs in a specific order. First pass shipment status 18, then 19, and finally 2. To integrate with Easy Ecom, you need to create an Easy Ecom user and generate its API token using authorization function. When integrating the carrier partner, the API token needs to be mentioned in the extra credentials to field. Carrier username and password should be recorded in username and password column, carrier token in token field and carrier account number in account number field. Easy Ecom team has shared the carrier integration workflow document and API document along with this tutorial. In case of any further questions, please contact Easy Ecom POC or write to us at carf at Easycom. I.O.